The first overtime game in Super Bowl history, they win it 34-28 over the Atlanta Falcons. We are fortunate to be joined right now by Super Bowl champion, oh, yeah, Chris baby. Long. Eight years with the St. Louis Rams, winning about four years or four games a year. You finally get to the Patriots and you win one in your first season. Yeah, man. I mean, that game, it was like being a part of the worst nightmare you could ever dream up. And then within an hour, we were all in this dream, this great dream. And uh, that team's got stones, man. I've never seen anything like it as, a, as an NFL fan and certainly not as a player. Well, you, you, but coming coming from the Rams, were you? I think you were in the piece, average four wins uh, a year for your your years there. What is the mentality when you walk into the locker room as a Patriot your first day? What's the mentality? I just want to do everything I can to help the team. Whatever my role is, week to week, whether it's playing three technique, playing nine, playing less snaps, being more of a third down guy in the playoffs. I mean, we got a bunch of guys like me who came in and decided we're going to do whatever we whatever it takes to make the team better. And that's what we have 53 guys like that, including the greatest of all time. Number 12. Hey, Chris, you know, at halftime, what did Bill Belichick say to the team? There wasn't much to say. I mean, we just we put our heads down and kept grinding. I mean, there were guys that had doubts. I mean, I had some doubts, but we had guys like Deron Harmon, who a lot of people don't know, but he's made big plays throughout his career. And he came and said this is going to be the greatest comeback of all time. And I kind of looked at him like, man, we just need to get a stop or we just need to score. Right, right. I, but we did it. I was standing on the end right when you, when Tom and him started to drive, tie the ball game yeah. up. And this guy turns to me, a total stranger, and he said, he says, man, do you really think they can go all the way down? I said, oh, yeah. Oh, they're yeah. they're going to go all the way down. And they did. You, you, it's, do you? Do you ever get to sit back and say one of these days I'm going to be able to say I was a part of the greatest coach and the greatest quarterback that ever played this game? I mean, I'm already looking at it that way. I, I was a part of history tonight, a small part, but a part of it. I mean, and we it was a bunch of guys that played team football, and we and we grinded it out. We scratched and clawed to do it. And Tom, at the end, we knew we weren't going back on the field on defense. He ripped their hearts out, and that's what he does. He's an assassin. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, everybody knows Howie Long is your father. Now you've got the same number of Super Bowl rings here. Yeah, we do. I did it in nine years. It took him 13. So that's kind of sad. But, you know, obviously you guys... <laughs> Obviously, he has a, a mustard-colored hey, hey, hey. jacket. Now, now you see what my house is like. <laughs> this is probably just a small That's why portion. He's tough. But the one thing I want to ask you here is, you guys had a chance to share a private moment down there, but publicly tell us how it feels to share this moment together here tonight. Man, and you know, not to minimize my dad, he's my he's my best friend in the world. Love him to death. He's been a great example for me. But I have my whole family here. I have my son Waylon here, my wife Meg, you know, my mother, my in-laws, my brothers. That's what this thing's about. You'll never forget something like this. I mean, this is a memory that so few people get to enjoy. How about you, big guy? You got something you want to say? We don't want to hog their time. I, 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 I told him, I, I, this is a guy who I've seen work so hard. He's always done it the right way. He's always been a great teammate, a great brother, a great son, a great father, a great husband. If anyone deserved the opportunity, and to win a championship, it's this guy. I love him to death, and I'm so thrilled for him. This hasn't really sank in for him yet. Yeah, this I guess will. not. I mean, uh, he's biased. I love him to death. We got a lot of guys, man, like me that came in hungry, and that came in trying to trying to make, you know, make carve out a role for themselves on the team. And that's what this this team is about. We set the bar high for performance and versatility and flexibility, and guys meet it because they want to win. They meet coaches' expectations which a lot of people wouldn't do, but you attract the right people. Yeah, that's and, and, and we listen to Bill, and you know this better, Jimmy, than anybody. He said it. He wants players that love football, players that are unselfish. Yeah, right. and, you know, not want to get sacks, want to do what the, you've and, already said. And it. loving football isn't about loving it every day. Some days you're going to hate football, but the feeling you feel <laughs> on a day like today, oh. you wouldn't trade all those crappy days that we worked harder than everybody else. Could you ever imagine this during those crappy days, those days that's, of that's losing? That's the thing that keeps you going. We got the toughest guys in the league. They showed it here today. Uh, we overcome a lot as a team, and we overcome things on a weekly basis, more than, than most people see. All right, we want to say congratulations to yeah. you on winning the Super Bowl, but we want to thank you. Maybe Howie can relax now around the studio yeah. when he watches these <laughs> Patriots games. He was in one one. Yeah, I know. I he's, think, he's nervous. I think he watched more film than you did. <laughs> 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 did he cry like a baby up here? No, no, no. No, he's good. Give it up, Howie. Go Don't ahead. Cry on TV. <laughs> Let it go. All your street cred is gone. It's gone. <laughs> My street cred left years ago. <laughs> Congratulations to you and all the Patriot players out there and oh. their families.